Could the Chicago Bears potentially trade quarterback Justin Fields? No, this is not clickbait before you click away. Just hear me out. All right, this is not clickbait. I'm going to tell you exactly where the story is coming from and why it is not clickbait, okay? But before I do, if you're new to the channel, welcome. Make sure to hit that big red subscribe button, guys. I post videos every single day uh, about the Bears and about Chicago sports. Make sure you go ahead and do that in larger NFL and NBA as well. So, Let's talk about this, all right? So Bleacher Report came out with an article talking about how the Chicago Bears, who have an opening at head coach and an opening at the general manager position, are a desirable location for potential head coaches and GMs, but more so GMs, because of a roster construction standpoint and the fact that they could possibly trade Justin Fields, all right? This is straight up coming from Bleacher Report for Mike Sando, um, I believe uh, he is a reporter, and he is talking about this. Now, again, it's not Shefty, it's not Ian Rapport, any of these uh, mainstream NFL guys that we're used to getting the breaking news from. But listen, folks, this is why I'm saying I'm not making this story up out of nowhere. Like, oh, should the Bears trade Justin Fields? It's actually coming from some sources. So let's talk about why or where this is coming from. All right, the notion that the Bears should trade Justin Fields or will trade Justin Fields, it's laughable, right? Right, like you have the one asset on your roster in Fields, who's got the potential to be a franchise quarterback, and now there's th thoughts about trading him. It's a very simple explanation, folks, all right? And the explanation is, whatever this new GM is, or whoever he is, whenever the new regime comes in, in terms of the front office, if they are not sold on Justin Fields, then they may be looking to move him and get somebody in the building that they are sold on now then the question begs why would you ever ever hire a gm who is not sold on justin fields good question and this is where again from reading other articles and other sources i've seen reports that apparently the mccaskies weren't very happy with justin fields development now let's be honest about this justin fields rookie year was not very good we know that we get that all right, I, I put out a video talking about his rookie season and what grade I would give him. All right, and it wasn't a very good grade because, again, more t interceptions than touchdowns. Obviously, he had a bunch of turnovers. Uh, you know, he was up and down at times, uh, a bit of injury prone. But again, there's things that was working against his favors and a bad head coach in Matt Nagy, bad offensive line, receivers dropping passes. The list goes on and on. Ultimately, I want to keep Justin Fields. I want to build around Justin Fields because it is hard to draft and find a quarterback with talent the level of Justin Fields. And the fact that he had as bad of a statistical season as he did, by the way, last in QBR of all qualified quarterbacks, and still we see the potential of Justin Fields, that's hard to find. That's hard to find. So what I'm basically trying to tell you is these rumors are coming out, and I'm not saying it's going to happen, but what I'm telling you is it's not completely – out of the air dust, just, you know, no, no chance of happening. There's a non-zero chance, potentially. I don't think it happens, but there's a non-zero chance. And that's literally if a new regime comes in. And for whatever reason, the McCaskies, if they do this, that would be dumb. But if they do this, they're like, oh, yeah, we, we like the regime. Do whatever you want with Justin Fields. And they're like, we don't want Justin Fields. We want to trade him and get a first-round pick and draft our own quarterback. If the new regime wants to do that, then that's what they would do. And again, that would be the McCaskies hiring somebody that would do that. So to me, again, I'm not saying this is going to happen. In fact, I'm going to tell you it is very unlikely, very unlikely, because we know the Bears fan base would not be very happy. And folks, I'm telling you right now, we do have a voice and we play a part in this process because of the fact that, you know, we have put notice to the Bears management that we won't stand for medi mediocrity in terms of, you know, we were not happy with, with Matt Nagy, they let him go. We were not happy with Ryan Pace, they let him go. They know the bad PR they'll, they'll get. So I think this is very unlikely it happens, but I'm just telling you, I'm stunned to see reports like this. Like the McCaskies would really consider bringing in a GM that is not sold on fields. Like that to me is laughable. So to me, again, non-zero chance, these are not rumors I'm making up, legitimate sources here, reports coming out about the Bears potentially trading Justin Fields. I wouldn't worry too much. I don't think it happens. But again, I thought it was important to let you guys know just, you know, what's going on with regards to this new regime that could potentially be coming in. 
And depending on whoever they hire at general manager, you know, ultimately they get to decide and dictate if they want to keep Justin Fields or not. And again, that's up to the management, excuse me, that's up to the ownership to not hire somebody that's not sold on Fields, but we'll see what happens there. Ultimately, I'll tell you this much too, all right? That Justin Fields is the biggest asset that the Bears have and keeping him is imperative, but I will say, but at the end of the day, I'm a Chicago Bears fan first and foremost, as of, as are you guys, I'm sure. And I just want a city, the city of Chicago to get a Super Bowl. And whether or not Justin Fields is the quarterback that brings us that, I honestly don't care. I just want to win. And I just want a Super Bowl. But having you with Justin Fields would be nice. So there you have it, folks. Let me know what you guys think. Again, you guys can read the same report that I'm reading. Let me know your thoughts down below. I think it's preposterous, but who knows? Leave a comment down below as always.